Hello, how you guys doing? You want to say hi, Broads? <laughs> no, do you want to say hi? Brody, the camera's over here, honey. You want to say hi? No? Okay. Um, today is, I don't even know, it's Tuesday, the 16th of January. Got my little tree going behind me. We had this up obviously in the for Christmas time out front, but I just thought it was too pretty to uh, not have up inside. And um, I like the Halloween ones that they have, but I haven't been able to find that. So when I found this all in white, I was like, oh, that is so cute. So, and I'm not sure if you can tell, it looks like it might be a little too bright. Um, but it is, I, mean, I don't think you can tell out there, but it is, flurries are coming down. And I've got this hat on because, good lord, my, um, hair is just crazy, ridiculous. Of course, Brody thinks it's time to use a squeaky toy. I just wanted to come on here and check in real quick. I also am not sure if I showed you guys last time my my little gnome nails. <gasps> um, but anyway, just coming on here to check in. I know I, I did very, very minimal over the weekend, um, although I did do a grocery haul. And uh, so that'll probably all go up in one. Um, but I'm doing okay. Uh, not bad. Um, but one thing I did want to come on here and say is something I know that I'm getting very frustrated at. Um, I don't even know how to word this. I'm at a point right now where I'm getting very, very frustrated with, um, like, because my hair is coming back now, you know, now it just kind of looks like, oh, she's just got a short do. Um, if I hide, you know, obviously my port. Um, now at this point, not many people would really know um, or would really, I guess, guess. And my frustration with that is that We're still going through a lot. It still takes so much to recover from this. And I'm getting to the point where I'm getting frustrated because I'm getting a lot of pushback um, or feedback that, you know, you look fine, what's wrong? You look like you're back to normal, you should be back to normal. Um, and it's just very frustrating to me because it's like, I realize I look better. I realize that by my hair, now you pretty much can't tell, um, that I'm a cancer patient, but it's still very frustrating because I'm still tired and I'm still recovering and I can't do everything that I used to be able to do. Hold on. Um, so that just does. It gets very frustrating for me to have to explain that to people or to even have some people that are, you know, somewhat close um, to be, it's like, did you forget what I just went through? Um, so I've reached that stage. That's fun. And the other frustration 
The other frustration is with myself um, that, and this can even go from moment to moment, not, not just day to day, but I, okay, I'll give an example. I was at my mom's house over the holidays and she, the way her house is, I mean, it's hard to explain, but it's, it's just a big like circle that you can do. And I was playing with um, the puppy, Chloe, and I ran around and had her chase me. And I did that like circle like three times. And, you know, I was definitely out of breath after that, but it's like I was able to do that. But on the other hand, the other day, I was trying to help clean and we have six dining room chairs. I literally vacuumed th the tops of three of the chairs because we have a cat and she gets her hair all over. I don't know why she likes perching on those chairs. Um, but I vacuumed real good, but the tops of three chairs and I needed to take a break. Then I vacuumed the area rug underneath the table. I needed to take a break. I tried working on some of the base, vacuuming some of the base trim, but like the bending over and doing stuff like that exhausted me. Like I was, I was done for a good three, four hours before I had ener any energy back again. So the back and forth like that drives me nuts because how do you plan for anything, you know? I mean, one minute I'm like, no, I can't do that. I know I'm still out of breath. But then another minute I can go for a 10 minute walk outside or, you know, can clean for a half hour or can do yoga for 20 minutes. I don't know. Sometimes I'm okay and sometimes I'm not. I don't, I don't, I don't know how to plan. And it drives me nuts. Because some days it makes me feel like the days that I feel like I can't, I feel like, come on, you're being a baby. What's what's the matter with you? Other days you can. Come on. So that's just where I'm at right now. But still can't complain. What's the point? So just thought I'd pop on and say toodles and um see how you guys are doing too i know i when i don't check in that means i'm not checking in and seeing how you guys are doing so i apologize for that on my end um, i hope you guys are all doing well i don't know what areas you live in but for us in new york it's winter and it's pretty crazy. Let me see if I can get you a little closer. Ah, I'm on the floor. Oh, Ooh, that might have not been such a good uh, idea. Okay. Grab all my quartz. Let's get you turn around so you can see this front window. Now the amount of snow is nothing for us. Like this is what we would consider a dusting. But it's been the wind and how cold it is. That was like a storm for us a couple days ago. And then this is what's left. And I don't know if you can see if it shows up, but just the, let me see if I can zoom in. Yep, you can see that it's snowing now. Not much though. I mean, it's just little, little itsy bitsy. Okay, well, I will see. It even pops out the bottom. I can't. I just can't control this mane. 
Um, all right, well, I will check in with you guys a little bit later, maybe. See what we're doing for dins. And yeah, I'll check in with you later. Bye-bye. Thank you.